The Satanist punctually undraped their monument's projected design, a winged creature with the body part of a man, the top of a goat, and horn sits on a throne to a lower place at pentagram, two fingers with wisdom raised as two youngsters look on in wonder. Satanists, it seems, have a way of humor. However, what do Satanists really believe? That seems to be a troublesome question to answer. Maybe unsurprisingly, Satanists are a rather fractious bunch, with many various organizations, beliefs, and rituals. Several of those organizations are all or part a cult, with a lot of hidden from non-adherents. Some are spiritualists. They worship Beelzebub as a deity. Adherents of the thrill of Satan ministries. For instance, know Satan slash Lucifer as a true being, and believe he's the true father and creator god of humanity. Others notably the Church of Satan, based by Anton LaVey, and therefore the Satanic Temple are materialists, and reject belief in supernatural beings. A voice for the Satanic Temple describes himself as an atheist once it involves supernatural beliefs, and says that for him sorcery stands for individual sovereignty within the face of tyranny, and the pursuit of information even once that knowledge is dangerous. LaVey's Satanic Bible proclaims life is that the great indulgence death the good abstinence. So build the foremost of the here and now, up for ye this day, this hour, for no redeemer life, despite these differences, found commonalities link several non-secular and materialist branches of Satanism, specifically a belief that the worship of a supernatural divinity and therefore the faith structure that evolved to support such worship places gratuitous restrictions on human knowledge and progress, and a belief in science, rationality, and learning, while not restrictions. Peter Gilmore, LaVey's successor as head of the Church of Beelzebub, distinguishes between carnal individuals and non-secular people. He believes the latter want a spooky begetter within the sky, whereas he's happy being the middle of his universe. During this sense, materialist sorcery appears shut too, if not indistinguishable from organized atheism, or maybe atheism with rituals. However, Mr. Gilmore says his church uses Satan in the original Hebrew sense as the adversary a figure who can arise and challenge. Satan in this sense becomes a kind of literary figure or trope for difficult orthodoxy, instead of evil or bloody-minded God. All of this is considerably less headline-grabbing than animal sacrifice or ritual murder. The Lave philosophy is very secure in the idea that things like sympathy and compassion were weaknesses and those selfish goals would always win out and that individualistic behavior was kind of divorced. That others falling behind was the natural order of things. The Satanic Temple isn't really down with that. In fact, Greaves insisted science proves altruism is an important part of a well-developed mind. 2. Not all priests speak on our behalf and may even choose to keep their affiliation secret if beneficial to do so. Machiavellian methods are notably current in skilled circles because of the manifold thoughts encompassing sorcery. The most associate degree most persistent misconception regarding Satanism and Satanists is that we have a tendency to believe and worship an anthropomorphous or supernatural being referred to as Satan or the devil. This is often false. Satanists are atheists who adopt Satan as an emblem of passion, pride, liberty, and heroic rebellion within the tradition of the proto-Satanic themed poetry and writing of Jyasu Kardachai. Lord Byron, John Milton, Benjamin de Cassers, Mark Twain, et al. that predate the foundation of the Church of Satan. The philosophical ideas at the heart of sorcery are atheism, scientific skepticism, organic process biology, social Darwinism, heroic individualism, meritocracy, lex talionis, hierarchy, pragmatism, aesthetics, dark romantic realism, humor, carnality, Epicurean indulgence in balance with Lycurg and Spartan vitality. A fictitious character can to explore up-to-date technology tempered by a respect for the past, and a passion for life and nature. One will realize common abstract ground with the likes of Ragnar Redbeard, Friedrich Nietzsche, H. L. Mencken, Ayn Rand, Jack London, and H. P. Lovecraft, all of whom were acknowledged as influences on Satanism. Dr. LaVey's vision to synthesize varied faculties of thought together with his own original ideas and symbolism, developed into a wholly distinctive and powerful philosophy, and a faith for the irreligious, that continues to inspire and grow over 50 years when its inception. And, of course, some individuals are guilty of horrific acts nominally committed within the name of Satan. However, these are hardly the primary murders committed in an exceedingly religion's name, and there's no proof to counsel that such killers are additional or representative of sorcery than alternative religiously impressed murderers are of their faiths. Thank you for watching. If enjoyed and found value in this video, 
please give it a thumbs up. Share your thoughts in comments below, and be sure to subscribe our channel. Have a great day.